Hello. Hello everyone. Welcome to Kumari's Home Cooking. Today I have a, another recipe. It's called ghee roast chicken. So the ingredients you need, I'm going to show you right now. For seasoning, I'll show you first. Seasoning the chicken, you need half kg. It's like half, I mean half a chicken. If you have, if you want to increase more, then you have to increase the other spices more. So this is half chicken. You need three tablespoons of yogurt. I'm going to season this for one hour. And a small piece of jaggery. And half a lemon. And half teaspoon of salt. And I'm going to season this with turmeric powder also. So I'm seasoning with half teaspoon of turmeric powder. So I'm going to mix this and leave it aside for an hour. Okay, for the spices, you need uh, one teaspoon of coriander, one teaspoon of cumin, ten dried chilies. This is uh, Kashmiri chili, four, and I have uh, five the other ordinary chili. Uh, if you want more spicy, you can add, and I have a little bit of ginger and garlic, and. Uh, half teaspoon of fenugreek and one teaspoon of pepper I, you can put the whole pepper because i'm going to blend all this so i have the powdered one so i'm putting the powdered one so i'm going to dry roast all this and then i'm going to blend okay i'm going to dry roast the chili first for two three minutes So it's like three minutes. Now I'm going to add in the jeera, the coriander, and I'm also adding the ginger garlic and the fenugreek. Pepper I'm going to add later because it might get burned because it's already in a powder form. So let me dry roast this for two minutes okay now I'm going to put in the ghee and roast the chicken for like half cook so for the half chicken you need three tablespoon of ghee and you need more later while you are cooking with the spices Okay, I'm going to put in all the chicken and occasionally put it in this all the time. I'm going to cook this for at least 10 minutes okay it's already like 10 minutes and uh, I'm going to take this out and put it aside and then we're going to put in all the spices and cook okay now I have blend the chili and the spices and I'm going to add in the same pot which I fried the chicken with the ghee and I'm going to cook this spices inside 
I'm going to cook this at least 10 minutes for all the spices to get cooked well. So I'll see you in 10 minutes. Okay, the chili is almost done. It's less than 10 minutes. So I'm going to add in the chicken and cook for another 10 to 15 minutes. And you have to keep stirring all the time. And you have to add in ghee in between. Because it takes a lot of ghee, that's why it calls ghee roasted chicken. Okay, I'll see you in another 7 minutes. Okay, I'm adding in a little bit more salt because you need more, a little bit more salt. Altogether, you might need more than a teaspoon. So, so always make sure you keep the heat in uh, medium, not too high. I'm going to add in the, uh, another 2 tablespoon of ghee. And that's it. Don't add in more. Okay, it is done. Almost done. We have another 2-3 minutes. We will be done. I'm going to put in the curry leaf now. Actually, I add in few earlier. But just to make it look nice, I'm going to add in a bit more. Mmm, look at that. It's so tasty. Mm, yummy. Okay, it's going into the plate. And it's ready to eat. This is for my dinner. Guys, you must try this. This is amazing. Okay, I have finished my ghee roast chicken. Guys, please try this at home. It's amazing. And uh, thank you for watching. And please don't forget to subscribe, comment and like. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye, take care.